Hello, Raw Mithril here once again, getting back to Cuphead, and today I think we're going to be taking on the boss that I wanted to fight earlier. So yeah, let's prepare a bit. I kind of want to stick with Super 3 just to see what it does. But I think I want Charge and maybe Roundabout. Yeah, let's go with this for now. Werner Vermin in Marine Corps. Yes, I know about weapon switching. You don't have to tell me about that. Okay. Oh, I get it. Cherry bombs. Okay, so that's what we need to parry. Do those count? Okay, so as you move, it changes the direction that the ghost is moving, but you can't just make it stand still. Yeah, that feels super awkward. Up, oh, that was still out. Really have to keep an eye on all the bottle caps. As well as the flamethrower, that too. And suddenly cat. Yes, now we're fighting a cat. And, well, mouse ghosts. Or are they rats? I'm, I'm not really sure what we're going with here. I forgot I had this. by the paw. Hiss! Hiss! Meow! We didn't do horribly for our first run, and it looks like we were almost done, but not quite. Hmm. Okay. Two things. One, I just cannot really feel like I'm using Super 3 all that effectively. So I think we're gonna go back to Super 1. Just give me the energy beam. Two? I'm actually not really sure roundabouts what I want to go with here. It might be another one that's good for Chaser, actually. So, we'll try this. Here's a real high-class bout. Here goes! <laughs> So at the very least, we've seen all the available phases to this fight. And yeah, I don't think that did anything for my EX meter, so I don't think parrying those really counts. Okay, I wasn't quite sure if I was going to make that or not. Jumped right into the flamethrower. I mean, we've already seen this phase, so let's just get a fail quote. This tank is the ultimate weapon. You will not win. It feels like maybe that's going to be a good phase for the chaser, just so I can concentrate more on dodging the bottle caps. We'll have to see.
I didn't mean to use an EX attack there. Oops. But we're already back to full, so it's all good. Uh, I had nowhere I could go there. Here's a real high class belt. It's on. <laughs> I just noticed that you can see Werner's eyes through the little holes in the can. That's a nice detail. Okay, let's get the fail quote for the first phase. You weren't giving me any parry opportunities anyway. It's up as easy as eins, zwei, drei. Here's a real high-class belt. It's on. I'm not really sure how I got through that, but okay. I'd be a fool to question it. So yeah, let's just try this for the moment. See how this goes. Because, yeah, with this I can keep a bit of a better eye on what's going on around me. And I can also duck while still keeping up the pressure. But from here on out, I think we can go back to this safely. Okay, and if those pink orbs hit the ground, they split. That's good to know before it became a problem. I think we got it! And the cat was a robot the whole time. But how does that explain the ghost mice? Are we just gonna gloss over that one? So yeah, there we go. So overall, that one's not too terribly bad. Kind of a breather fight here on Isle 3. And we get the Werner Vermin Soul Contract. So that, that's where we're going to call it for today. A bit of a short one, even though it was a boss fight. This one, like I said... It's just, it's fairly simple once you know what you're doing, and Seeker actually makes the second phase a lot easier, because you can concentrate more on the pattern of the flamethrowers, and just which bottle caps are about to come after you. So, yeah, again, all the shot types really seem to have good places to use them. I like that. I like that there isn't really a weapon in this game that feels completely useless. Even Super Art 3, as awkward as heck as it is, I'm sure if you know what you're doing, you can make really good use of that. But, uh, I don't think I was. But yeah, we're gonna call it here for now. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series so far, and I shall see you again next time. Until then, fare thee well.